Hi and welcome to HUDKing.com, your source for real virtual tours in HUD homes in and around the San Antonio area. If you're watching this on HUDKing.com, click on the bird to follow us on Twitter, click on the F to follow us on Facebook, or click on the YouTube link to be taken to our YouTube page. While you're at our YouTube page, if you click on the subscribe button, you'll be instantly notified of new uploaded videos. Now on to the home. We are here at 8514 Rita Blanca. That's 8514 Rita Blanca over in Escondido Creek of Converse. It's a nice four bedroom, two and a half bath home. Approximately 1,975 square feet. It was built in 2006. A relatively new construction. Exterior is a combination of wood and brick. The home sits on about a 6,000 square foot lot and it is about $11,000 underneath the county appraisal. Probably the best price per square foot home in the neighborhood, which is commonly what we find in HUD homes. Usually one of the best priced homes in the neighborhood. Two story, it looks like it needs a little bit of painting on the exterior, but that's pretty minor. Let's take a look at the backyard and we'll look at the inside. Well, we step into the backyard from a door off of the dining room. Has a nice little deck here. Could use some painting. A few slats of the fence are missing, but that's all pretty minor. And a rear view of the home. Actually, exterior wise, in decent shape. All it looks like it really needs is a fresh coat of paint, and then this thing would really pop. There's a few pieces of damaged corners of the window here. You can see that they fixed it. However, it is still damaged. If it was me and I bought it, I would probably just come back and replace those boards around the window. It's a little bit easier to do that. But exterior wise, in nice shape. Let's look at the inside. Well, as we step into the home, it immediately has ceramic tile on the entryway. And as you've probably heard me say in many of my videos, if you've watched them, I think that's a great um, kind of a little upgrade accent to do because if your shoes are dirty, let's say it's raining, you don't dirty up your carpet. Now, some of the bedrooms are upstairs. Luckily for us, the master is downstairs. It has a real high vaulted ceiling in here. And we have the option of going straight or if we turn left, if we turn left, then we have a formal dining room, or it could be a formal living, but I think this is really a formal dining room because it's right off of the kitchen. It has a really high ceiling, it has carpet in there, and it has paint, but I think everything in the home really is in great condition. It's definitely a nicer condition HUD home than we normally see. You have a passageway into the kitchen, but we'll come back to that. Now, if we were to continue walking into the home, on to the right here, we have a little storage underneath the staircase. And then we have your half bath here. So the half bath is a single uh, commode here and then a single vanity. They do have linoleum flooring in here, so you probably want to replace that. I don't think you need to, but you could. Then we're into your main living room. High ceilings, it just makes the home seem real open. It has a lot of windows, giving it a lot of natural ambient lighting. If we turn to the left here, we come into your kitchen. Now, we do have that entryway into your dining room there. Here we have access into your pantry, which is a really good sized pantry, it's your walk-in pantry. And then we have your kitchen, which has a ton of cabinet space, a ton of cabinets, uh, countertop space, an opening into your living room. You have this opening here into your breakfast area. It's really light, bright. You have that door that takes you out to the backyard, high ceilings in your dining room. And then we come over back to your living room. Really nice open space. As I said, high ceilings, really open. It makes the room home feel really a, a, a lot larger than it normally would feel. We have a nice fireplace there. And if we come over around the corner here, we'll have bedroom number one or your master bedroom, the lower level. Master bedroom's actually in great shape, really just probably needs some touch-up paint. Has a high ceiling, a carpet's in decent shape. We have your master bathroom here. Master bathroom has dual vanities. And then you have a big garden tub and shower combo. Probably a little linen closet right here. And then your master closet right here. It's a good sized closet. Your commode obviously right here. Let's take a look over here. We have your indoor laundry room. So your washer and dryer connections are here inside. And then we have access into your garage. Pretty standard two car garage. Has a water filtration system. Home looks like it's wired for an alarm. So downstairs really, just maybe some touch up paint. I think downstairs is in excellent condition. I think you could probably get away with keeping the carpet so you don't have that expense when you move in. Carpet on the staircase is in great condition. Whoever lived here really took care of the home. So if we go to the left over here, we have bathroom number two. Bathroom number two is a single vanity, shower and tub combo. Has linoleum flooring, that really doesn't need anything. Bedroom number two, really bright. I really don't think it needs anything either. This home is actually in better condition than some of the other regular homes I've shown. Non-foreclosures. And then this is bedroom number three. Bedroom number three 
in good condition. Carpet's in great shape, paint's in great shape. A little window here in the closet. So you may want to paint it, as you can see there. A few little blemishes in the paint, but it's pretty minor. And then we come over and we have bedroom number four. That's about it. Homes, as I said, is in great condition. It is about $11,000 underneath the county appraisal. This is probably one of the better buys on the list right now as far as condition of the home. Let me give you a summary. Well, there it is, 8514 Rita Blanca Street. That's 8514 Rita Blanca Street. This is a very nice home in Converse, Texas, in Escondido Creek. This home is listed for about $11,000 underneath the county appraisal. One of the best homes for the price in the area, listed for only $145,000. So if you're interested in this home and you don't have a realtor, I would love to earn your business. You can reach me at 210-706-0616. My name is Jonathan, I am the HUD King, and I want to help you find your castle.